Ba-ding! Gordon, we've got to get to White Forest. If you hear the sound of Alex Vance nagging me to get on the elevator, then you know you're watching my playthrough of Half-Life 2 Episode 2. My name is Marcus Stewart, and welcome to part three of my adventure. Of course, last time we uh ended by rest. Yes. We rescued Alex. And now we are on our way to the White Forest because the G-Man showed up and said some things in Alex's head. And is Alex's hair multicolored? Has that always... Has she always had multicolored hair? I don't think I knew that. I'm kind of looking at it now. Like, look at it. Can you... Oh, shit. <laughs> Accidentally shot the, the grenade. Um, I was trying to zoom in. You can walk on my own now. Let me give it a shot. I forgot there's no iron sights. Well, I gave it a shot, all right. Thankfully, I didn't kill any of you guys. But yeah, the shiv. Yeah. Can you tell? Stiff, but... I think I'm okay. I always thought Alex just had like brownish black hair. It's like multicolor. She's like Jeff Hardy. The rainbow haired warrior. The real one. Um, but yeah. Uh, what the, what? Oh. Oh, that thing. Whoa. The thing that kicked my ass last the time. Guardian. Somebody must have done something to piss yeah, it look, off. Yeah, look. You see that? Can you. The Guardian can you is enraged over our theft of the extract. If it tries to hinder our progress, Look at that. we'll have no choice but to kill it. You messed with its eggs? Oh, no wonder it's mad. I mean, what do you want me to... Oh! Oh! That is all we can spare. Okay, I thought... I was like, are you healing me because I shot my grenade in the elevator like a doofus? So yeah, let's make our way up these stairs. Uh, last episode was a, a good episode in terms of progress. We managed to rescue, embark on our rescue of Alex and pull it off by the end. So let's see, uh, I don't know, can we get to the White Forest? In one episode, Freeman Pontifex. I don't know what Pontifex means, but that's a, uh, that's a million dollar word if I ever heard one. You must have heard that word from New York City. New York City? on the move. Yes, and they carry Shuhulathoi, advisors still in incubation pods. They gather and unite oh. the scattered combine forces. I'm gonna hold it. So that's what we saw in the Citadel. They're sure in a hurry. They move north with great purpose. North? White Forest! We have to get there ahead of them. I know of humans with a vehicle not far from here. They will understand our... See, look at her hair. What are we waiting for? It's like red, purple, some green in there. Does everybody know that? I don't know why I'm fixated on that. I just... I, all this time, I never noticed. <laughs> Alrighty, let's make our way a north, then. Da -da -da. That's a nice change of pace out in the... In the forest, so we're not in some dingy underground like factory or uh, like get trapped in an elevator. Look at this. If I was reviewing this game I, uh, back in the day, we would we would call this lush. Some good sound design there, and the, uh, you can hear the thumping of the big daddy long leg looking things. We are the triple team. What the? Oh, look at us. All right. 
Good job, bro. Bam. Who's hitting me? Okay, where did Alex go? What's she doing? Make a break for the thumper, Gordon. I'll follow you. Thumper? Shotgun this guy's in the shoddy. There we go. Um I guess I'm just gonna keep going forward. I don't know what the thumper is, but she'll make itself clear. It's not one of these things, these things are thumping. The humans have their enclave on the rim of this cave. The enclave. Again, love that sound. It's very satisfying. Might be up there with the most satisfying video game, like healing sounds. Can I break that? That looks breakable, right? This is probably a waste of this canister, but. Oh, well, it did break the board, but. Mm. Eh. Just wondering. Can I push that? Push, can't pick it up. Where else are they? Should I keep going? I'm gonna leave you guys. You guys got this. There's two of you. Oh, oh god. Okay. Me and you, buddy. Now that I'm allowed to fight you. Got a bone to pick. Alright, get this can. <clears throat> I need a witty one-liner for this. Uh, how about you can it? It's pretty good, right? Uh, you're about to get canned. Oh, I guess that's me. I am canned. I deserve that for that terrible piece of dialogue. Uh, that's all right. Uh, where did you come from? This? Are you already out? Nope. Get ready. I keep forgetting you, I can't run. Uh, uh, come here. Right, come on, bro. Oh, the. Oh. Yeah. Heal me, bro. Cool. Can you heal me without consequence? Thank you. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay. Ugh, I was trying to get out of the way. Got a little too close. Oh boy. Oh boy. What are they? Is he fighting the antlines too? Will they distract each other? Yeah, I'm working on it, Alex. Really am. Ah. What? It kick a rock in my face? Is that what that was? Okay. Break. Oh, nothing. All right. Um. Boom. Go. That's how you dodge. It's like bullfighting, but maybe a little bit more ethical. God damn, because it's in self-defense. Well, I guess bullfighting is technically in self-defense, alright? If you don't fight the bull, you'll get stabbed to death. I don't know. Heal me. I require your healing services, sir. Uh. Oh man. Okay, I'm out of bullets there. Oh yeah, give me that. Give me that suit armor. Please? Anymore? Okay. Um, and Alex, you're just. You got a gun, you wanna use it? <laughs> just taking a breather? 
Well, you got a gun. You can certainly help with that. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Where, where's the big one? I don't care about you, really. Oh, jeez. That's the other one. Oh, okay. I was like, is he dead? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Don't like this. Oh, I thought it was dead. Get back in the little cubby. Safe zone. And this jerk here. Okay, there we go. Oh! My god! It's... Oh! Alright, so that, that one likes to kick things. It's just the little FIFA player transformed into a abomination that spits in the face of God. Uh, the hell? It's the second time. It's, it's learned. It's learned that those things explode. It's like a velociraptor. This is its door opening. Are you gonna hit that thing? Oh jeez, I got stuck on the wall. Okay, that did some damage, and then this asshole. Oh jeez, I don't like. Okay. Oh boy, I wish you could run. Oh, actually, you can run. That's right. I figured that out last episode. I'm doing it now. That is right. Um, let's see. All right. Oh, this is gonna be a whole episode, isn't it? It's just this <laughs> trying to win this fight. Um. Man, Alex, you would be really helpful. Just, you know. He just kick a car. What was that? What did he just kick at me? That's the third time he's done that. It's the third time. I should. I feel like I should kill that guy first. The the green one doesn't kick stuff at you. At least not that I've seen. It's just this red asshole. But yeah, it was this thing. It's like a car engine. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna start the fight by throwing a car engine. Which is probably a stupid way to start the fight, but it hurt. I can keep doing it. Oh yeah, that that definitely hurts. It did a little split leg there. Made it made her knees shake. Ah. Okay. Oh. There's the. Oh my God! How many? Oh man, I just lost her. Oh okay, still that one. Oh my god, jeez. Now I have a rough idea how many shotgun shells it takes to kill one of them. I just, just, mm, just point blank. Oh. Oh god, no, we're not dying here. Not when I've killed one of them. Come on, come on. Yeah, actually, I got, uh, I got one grenade. Yeah? No? Get inside. No! I was trying to get inside! No! I was trying to get inside to be safe! Something killed me! Off screen, I think it was one of the little ones. Oh my god, I was doing so good this time. Okay. This is... Honestly, as stupid as it looked, a uh, engine thing. I don't even know if it does any damage, but it seemed like it did. It did react to it, so... Alright. Just what the hell? Okay, I still got you. So I'm just gonna shotgun you to death. Try to get as many licks in before your idiot friend shows up. Okay. Oh god, I'm up against the wall. I can't move. Okay. Uh, give me one. Eh, just the... Uh... Oh! Get in there, get in there! <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, buddy. Heal me up. Heal me up, buddy. I haven't. You, you owe me one. You haven't used it up yet. I don't think he's gonna do it, but. Okay, um, is it just. Got a little. Alright, he's dead. 
Is it just bad? Good job. Oh, oh! See that? Oh, oh! Stop throwing stuff. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna... All right. Trying to throw this at you without blowing myself up. But I can't see you. Oh, jeez, that almost hit me. Probably would have killed me just because. Dead. Dead. I'm trying not to get too close to that car. He's going to fling it. Um. guy's like Jackie Chan inside of a warehouse full of objects like like Jackie Chan in an antique store is invincible because he uses everything around him this is this is this guy he is grotesque insect Jackie Chan shit oh oh no 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 all right stay there let me just like oh, god I wish you could aim is that it oh he faked me out I thought that was like his death throes I am burning through all of my ammo with this stupid thing. That fit through the that fit through the hole. That I mean, I guess maybe, but I didn't think it would. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? I just want to clean all this shit up. Just if it didn't have any of this stuff, it's, that thing would be dead. Like I said, Jackie Chan in an antique store. Unbeatable. I mean, that was probably a waste. Look at him, he's kicking, at, kicking his little can. So he knows he's gonna fling it at me. I'm trying really hard. I mean, I, we killed the green one without consequence. That's not hard. Did, he, did the green one kick something at me? I mean, if so, it doesn't... Oh, get, you get out of here. There you go. Take that. Okay. Oops. Oh, now he wants to be all... Learn from his buddy. Now he wants to start throwing stuff. God, he can't see. Oh, oh, get out of there. I don't know where the other one is. Okay. Oh, God. One of you really needs to go. Uh, heals with the box. Okay. Uh, like... Yeah. Right, where are you going, buddy? All right, dead. Please die. And also, just stay there for a bit so I can just keep. Unloading on you. Don't fling that car. Don't you do it. What did I just tell you? Stop it. Damn. Oh, God. Oh! God damn it. Okay, God. Okay. I was trying to back up into the thing, but it did not work, obviously. What the? Oh, oh I thought that was going to fly over. Jesus Christ. Stop it. Stop it. Just, he's literally going for everything. Everything that's around him. He's looking for stuff to throw. I didn't even know that was there. He found it. <sighs> uh, only you could see. Oh, what the shit? I'm like afraid to throw this thing. I don't... I wish you would attack the big one. I mean, I guess it's good you're taking care of the little ones, but 
Just, oh my, every time he throws that, I'm like terrified it's gonna slip through here somehow. Uh. Ah, oh, that's it. Ooh, see like that. <sighs> Look, he's going for it, no. Oh my god, thank you! Wait, are there still more? Jesus Christ, you little stupid idiot. Huh. Nice work, Gordon. Sorry, um, couldn't be more help. I'm still a little weak. You know what, Alex? I forgive you, I guess. Well done, Freeman. Just this one time. Freeman, you dispatch those guards with great dispatch. Come now. The dispatch those guards with is great dispatch? That would you? All right, dude. Let's, uh, I don't have ammo for just about anything. Ammo-less. Yeah, charge this that up. Will carry us to where the vehicle awaits. I got it. Oh, oh, what's that? Uh, rocks are falling. Don't like that. Uh, oops. Where are we? Um. I'm not sure what am I trying to fix here. It's the elevator's not coming down. Uh, there's the elevator. How to make it come down? Is it? What's it stuck on? There's no way. Oh, shit! Now that I've just shattered my ankles. Uh... Come on. Oh, can I go in here? Actually, I mean, I don't think it'll solve the puzzle, but I'm just wondering. Yeah, no. Thought maybe there might be a, a secret. See if it was hiding any secrets. Can't jump. Oh. Ah! God damn it. Okay. Let's try that again, but without, with less, uh. Oh no. Oh god, where is it? Oh. Little. Okay, you guys are gonna have to deal with that. Uh, actually, I might have to. Is it dead? Okay, it broke its little ankles. Okay, let's see. I go up here. There we go. What happened? What happened? I don't know what happened there. Did the... Either the door hit me when I blasted it open, or I... Me dropping in there killed me? I'm... Honestly, the la the former sounds like nice the most work. likely, even though it sounds more ridiculous. Hey, what's our buddy doing down there? Ooh. 
There you go. Come on, man. Done, Freeman. Freeman, you dispatch those guards with great Hey, we're keep six feet, guys. You know watch the news? All we seek is in the encampment above. This lift will carry us to where the vehicle awaits. Okay. All right, let's try it again. Um, what the hell? I've died. I've probably died in this episode more than any other so far, or at least have died, the, have accumulated the most deaths in a the shortest amount of time. Did that do anything? Ah, uh, thanks, gross. Oh, I didn't mean the fall. At least I can kill it. Oh, god damn it! They slid off. I swear, Gordon Freeman's wearing like ice skates, and by that I mean he, he has literal slabs of ice ties, tied to his skates, so he's sliding around everywhere. Eh. Oh, no, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> dude, dude. Okay. Alright. Let's try this again, but with less death. It's saying that a lot. Okay. Where's the door? Okay. That must have been what it was. Maybe it flew so fast because this game is so physics driven that it just. Much like in real life, if you. It would just hit you in the face, you'd be done. Um, going that fast. Uh. Oh, jeez. Oh. Thanks, Gordon. The sentries should have spotted us by now. You think the Combine found them? Such a theory is hardly far-fetched. Hmm. Uh, but yeah, hope everyone, uh... Oh. oh, yes, I will lead us. Hope everyone out there is having a, a good time, or at least it's relatively good time that you can have, given what's, uh going on in the world right now, whether you're officially locked down and quarantined or not, you know, but everyone watching is uh, staying safe, uh, keeping healthy, um, you know, if you are sick, just, you know, chill out, ride it out, hopefully it'll, you know, it'll pass, but uh, man, what a crazy time right now, right, I mean, you got, thank God for, uh, what are you doing, if only we had this guy in every house to heal everybody, He's like, hey, you got the coronavirus, let me just vroom, vroom, and then green stuff hits you, and you're like, hey, I feel better, I think I'll go to work now. Um, if only life was that easy. <laughs> um, but in, you know, in all seriousness, I hope everyone's uh, doing well. Pulse rifle, oh yeah, I remember this gun. It's pretty, it's pretty good, right? Let's see. The Combine found them all right. But came to no good end themselves. Head crabs have had their way with both parties. Hmm. You don't want head crabs to have their way with you. Let's see, where are we going? What are you looking at? Hey, look! Out on that bridge. I think I see the car you were talking about. Which car? Oh, oh, you're looking at that, okay. It appears they attempted an escape, but made it no farther than the abyss. Well, if they got it over there, maybe we can jump it back to this side. We recommend the Freeman for this task. Hey, I'm feeling a lot better. That condition will not last long if you plunge into the toxins below. We would do well to lend our protection from above, while Freeman skirts the hazards in the pit. This mounted gun may prove useful. Okay. The gun would appear to be powerless. Hmm. Go, Freeman. I will look after the Alex Vance. 
Well, Gordon, I guess it's all up to you. I'll get yeah, you I'll soon. Get this field down. Uh, oh, I didn't even notice I was there. Good luck, Gordon. Thank you. Careful now. I just left. I already worried. I got this big ass halo gun. What is that? Uh, what side are you? Okay. Uh, da -da. Where am I trying to go? Can't wait to use this on somebody. They're gonna get it. They're gonna learn today. There we go. All right. I hear something. Might as well be screaming, please shoot me with your new gun. Running out of light. There we go. Oh, look at that. Chair is the only thing keeping this thing out of here. Oh, that thing's gross. Got so many head crabs. So many head crabs. Oh, that's, that's all the bullets I had, I guess. All dead. No surprises. Okay. I felt like I just it wasn't as a fact if I felt like it should have been. I don't know why I'd be doing it. Let's see. Um Oh there's so many boxes. Uh, can I just break all these? In the hopes that there's some ammo or some life inside. Let's see. Uh, da -da. Nope, nothing here. Just a bunch of empty boxes. Emptier than a episode of Monday Night Raw. Because they are not filming in front of crowds. Just like WrestleMania. That's crazy, right? Like, a, if any of you are listening are wrest wrestling fans, like, how do you feel about WrestleMania? Uh, being uh, taking place in the performance center in front of no fans. That sounds uh, kind of mixed on that. Cause on one hand, you're like, oh yeah, WrestleMania is still happening, and you know, in a time where a lot of us are confined to our home. I am not quarantined, by the way, at least not yet. Um, but for those who are, you know, any entertainment is great right now. But at the same time, I almost rather they either postpone it or just don't do it, because just the spectacle of WrestleMania, to see that reduced to, I wouldn't even say like a, a house show, because at least a house show is in a bigger venue with people, it just won't feel the same. You know, it's like, do I want, like, half-assed WrestleMania? Like, half-assed WrestleMania? Is that better than no WrestleMania? Nice shot. Nice shot, Alex. You're useful now. I don't know. I I I, I kind I want to see it just because it's such a a weird oddity. Like, what does that look like? Is, are we gonna get like the uh, the dramatic WrestleMania like package, and then it's just like, hello, welcome to the empty performance center for WrestleMania. Like, is Vince McMahon gonna make an appearance? Are we gonna get like uh, are there gonna be any pyro whatsoever? Oh, that's good to know. But that's there. Nice little tip off. You guys can't break the box, really. Oh, and I really hope there was anything useful in there. Um, but yeah, it's just, uh, you know, I don't watch sports, so the uh, the no sports thing has not really affected me, though I feel for the people that do love sports, and especially basketball fans, because uh, weren't the NBA Finals happening right now, or they're about to be happening? Because this is like the time of year that that happens, I think. Again, I'm not a sports fan, but I'm pretty sure the playoffs are about to start, or has started. 
Um, I kind of want to throw this up there just to kill all of them. Let's do it. Let's get crazy, as Bob Ross would say. Just have them all puke at once. Oh, look at all that. Oh, they're fine. Go come back down. Or at least one of them's fine. The other ones are kind of taking their sweet time. Um, but yeah, what a what a time to be alive, huh? So, I mean, the important thing is that. We are alive. As inconvenient as all this stuff is, and as inconvenient as this is, right now... Oh wow, that would have been death. If that... Oh! It will be death! <laughs> I thought I jumped! I guess not. Uh, yeah, as, as inconvenient as all this is, you know, it's important that we're all safe, healthy, it's, you know, it's a, it's a crappy short term, or at least hopefully short term. I guess short term in the grand scheme of things. Again, hopefully, for a, a better long term, you know, things kind of have to get worse before they can get better, all that kind of stuff. Oh, god damn it. I really want to know what's in that box, for, suddenly. I could have just sucked it to me with the gravity gun, I just thought of that. Instead of, uh, kind of being all extreme. Being all team extreme. It was worth it. Alright, so he's gonna, I'm gonna drop that. See if I can catch it. Pretty. Can't. Nope. Never mind. Well, at least I got that one. And then I'm gonna shoot it. Oh. Oh, thank you for that. Actually, I can just shoot it. Okay, that almost worked. Still, kind of got the job done. Uh. Bleh. You know what? If you're, uh, if you love video games as much as I do, and this is like your, uh, your passion, your enthusiast for it, well, that extra free time gives you plenty of time to not only play the new stuff coming out, we got, uh, at the time of this recording, or probably by the time this airs, which, which will be Friday, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, you alright? Oh, another one? Oh, Jesus. Okay, um, that was dark and disturbing as I was trying to, uh, <laughs> inject some positivity into this, uh, whole situation, but, um, yeah, like, at the time that this is airing, Doom and Animal Crossing will be out. Uh, you know, it's funny, you know, the joke with those games is that they're two very different games, and I, they cannot be more different games, or more different from each other, and they're coming out the same day, but they kind of, uh... They kind of fulfill a similar purpose in their own ways, um, in terms of being stress relievers. Whereas one, I don't have anything to stop this guy. Okay, I was like, oh, I had this handgun. But it's okay, it didn't really do much damage. Um, you know, they're both going to be pretty effective stress relievers for this, uh, this whole crappy situation we're in. Because Animal Crossing is so happy and delightful that, like, you know, it's a nice escape from all the negativity that's going on. But at the same token, Doom is so visceral... And what the heck? What is that? It's got no skin. Oh, oh, I got nothing. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no. What is? Oh, that's just a meat sack with a head crab. How are you even controlling that still? It's like Lord Zeb from Power Rangers if he was malnourished. Um, but yeah, like I was saying. Uh, speaking of disturbing things like this creepy bastard. You know, Doom comes out, and that's, uh, you know, it's all visceral and fast-paced and violent, and in a way, that's a stress reliever, too, because maybe you're really upset that you can't go to work and you can't leave your house, that you're like, I need to take this out on something, let me chainsaw a caco demon right in half there. And then if you get a little too tired of that, if your heart rate goes up too much, you're like, you know what, I'm going to chill out on my little island and uh, with my cool animal friends, and we're just going to hang out and, I don't know, decorate some houses. So two, 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 uh... Oh, jeez. Okay. Thank God. Yeah. Alright, you... I can't move. I'm stuck. What? I don't even know what killed me. I mean, I assume one of them got in a little swipe. A little swipey there. Mm. Mm. Excuse me. A sip of coffee. It's a little... It's, uh... Nighttime here right now. 
it's been a busy day. Just getting a little pick-me-up there. Um, okay, so that meat sack guy, is he gonna come back? Should I just throw this in there? I think he's alive, though. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... What? What? Did he throw it back? Did he throw it back? Or was it just... Did it just bounce like crazy and come back? Try that again. Okay. Oh! Oh! That's somehow scarier! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Ah! He's still coming! <laughs> oh! Oh! Somehow that was worse! <laughs> oh no! Oh. Alright, what if I... Because they're all going to get up anyway. Yeah, no dramatic light turnouts. So. Yeah, it's nothing you can't get me now. Yeah, ahead of the game. Oh my god, that flaming that flaming meat corpse. This guy, even the way he's still kinda sitting up is creepy. Like like he's still gonna come at me. Um Jesus, that might be the most disturbing thing I've seen in some time. Uh let's get the hell out of here. Uh, oh, I wish that laser was, you know, on this side. Wait, you having trouble getting through the door, dude? Are you gonna get all of them? Can I save some ammo? did that I just got <laughs> as I was oh here take the shard of a explosive container did you get him ah! I can't remember what they said but are there gonna be head crabs in half-life Alex because uh having a head crab tossed at you in VR sounds like a uh, prime way to give someone a heart attack Which I guess is why you would do it, <laughs> really, right? If you're gonna make a VR Half-Life game and not have first-person head crab attacks, then what are you doing? Oh, je oh, jeez, that hurt. Oh no, 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 no! Here, blow it up there. What? Hmm. Okay. Okay. Can't, at least put me past the dumpster. Had to have run. No! 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 <sighs> do I do it again? I mean, it saves me ammo. Can I... I should shoot this first. Because then I can run through there. Okay, he's got to be throwing it, right? Right? Okay. He's gonna die about here. Right? Right? Okay. Don't want that again. Jeez, that is creepy as hell. Excuse me, I'm gonna step over your smoldering corpse. Um, let's take care of this room. Are they all dead? I'm like a shot the health into my body. They got launched into me. Oh, one's still alive. Okay. Really need to pass this part so I never have to, uh... Oh my god, look at that. Sub-Zero was here, apparently. T taking care of business. Uh, <laughs> I can't tell if that's alive or not. Like, just give me a sign. Lord, give me a sign. I really gotta talk to you, Lord, cause the head crabs are coming. Don't know where from. Oh! Speaking of head crabs coming, what killed me there? Oh my lord, dumpster zombie, here we go again. Oh, I don't even know what got me. Was it the guy throwing the head crabs? Okay, is he always gonna throw it back the first time? Yes. And I'll never throw it back the second time. And then, and then, 
Run for your life. How does he even know I came up here? Let me see where I went. Oh, oh, he. If it wasn't for that bar, he probably would have flew right at me. Alright. I'm so sorry we have to keep doing this, guys. At least everyone's dead. Actually, the first time I've killed everyone in this room with that one bomb. So we're getting better. Alright, this is the one. I'm gonna call it now. This is the one. So where it all comes together. Head crap, it's dead? Okay. There you are. Okay, I think look hmm. And then trust it. No, I didn't tr okay. So that thing... God, that thing does so much damage. The head crap does so much damage. Jesus Christ. I want to get out of here. Oh, I wish I had more ammo for my other guns. Oh, no, you stay there. Alex, you got him? You owe me anyway for the force battle. So you should take care of him. Okay, 100% help. Oh, no! You little demon. Okay. Okay, I think... Oh yeah, that guy's gonna bust through the door. Alright, so I'm just gonna leave... I'm gonna leave that there. So that when he busts through, I can blow him up. Right? Coming? Alright? Coming? Come on. Oh god, you're gonna run after me too? Oh, something else blew up. Oh! Is that a room full of explosives? Uh. A lot of explosives. Can't charge that up. Ooh. Can I get to that? Can't get to that. Okay. Oh. Uh, okay. No. Oh! Oh, get, get out of her! Get out of her! Ooh. Ooh. Oh! God. God! Okay, you don't hit as hard as the black ones. Oh! Ooh, if that would have killed me. Oh man, if that would have killed me. Oh, I would not be happy. Okay, Jesus Christ. Harrowing, this whole area, I want to get out of here. Just death at every turn. Please tell me we're at some sort of checkpoint. Oh, look at this guy. Oh my God. Who did that? It's like the, uh, what's the gun in, what video game has a gun? I mean, there's a few video games that have a gun that shoot, uh, like, buzz saws and a ricochet everywhere. That's kind of in a couple games, like a Ratchet and Clank has one of those, right? I should know, I'm a big Ratchet and Clank fan, so that, I'm pretty sure there's a gun that basically is like that, but I, didn't Resistance have one, too, or, Gears of War has one, for sure, like, Gears 5 had it. Looks like you got hit with one of the several types of those. Okay, did I get ammo from my cool gun? Okay, good. All right, I'm. Oh, I picked you up. Okay, I was like, why are you stuck to me? Okay. Got the duck under you. Get him, Alex. I need Get him out. Shot, Where are you? Um, I'm sure there's a hole for me here somewhere. I can make one. There we go. All right. I 
Ashley, you're a problem. Oh, you broke my scaffolding. You jerk. Oh boy. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, there's a lot of you guys. Oh. Oh boy. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Start me here, right? Start me here, right? Damn right. <sighs> okay. I sounded really close. What if I just... Like, from here... Oh, yeah, I'll probably hit somebody, right? Okay, yeah, I got that little piece of crap. There we go. You can have that too. Like head crabs. Yeah. Okay, you need to die. Oh, you're already dead. Oh, those black ones are the worst. God, they hit so hard. Oh, hi. God, I'm trying to get... Oh, I see a black one scurrying around. Alex! Oh, thank God. No, we don't want those. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. God damn it. Oh god damn. It. Oh god. God. Mm! Was I not far enough away? That got me? Like, really? Okay, at least it checkpointed me during the fight. So. Is that glass? That's bulletproof laser. Um. Uh, no. Oh, thank you. Don't want it. Like you're waiting to fight in the gulag in Call of Duty Warzone. Okay, this. Where's the other guy? Where's the other grenade guy? Where did they... Where did that break down at? Real combat heavy episode. Okay. Once again, I need my Vortigon buddy. Um, hmm. Fine. No? Can I move anything? Boop, boop, boop. Nope. 
Can I climb crawl under this? Yes, I can. I most certainly can. Oh, hi. Shotgun shells. All right. Um, okay. Get your climbing these these uh, shelves here. Let's get up. Getting up like we're Mark Echo. <laughs> That's a deep cut reference there. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Jeez. Okay, I can't make that jump. Probably. Um, Let's go around this way. Uh, mm, mm. Uh. Uh. I would say I can't do that. Are we trying to go? Okay, that looks like. How do I get there? Can I reach that? I doubt it. I can't even jump to the other side over there unless I. But then, would I climb this? And no, that's not it. Hmm, be stacked. Oh shit, it's not showing. Put it down. Oh wow, that it worked. All right, please make this jump. Thank God, okay. All right, now we're going. Now we're playing with power. You got this. Don't touch the sewage. Don't touch it. I certainly hope so. Alright. The light is fading. Where are you pulling these out from? Wow, that was lucky. Not so lucky for you. What? Okay, that was almost... <laughs> that was almost very unlucky. Let's see. It's starting to come up on our time, so I kind of see if I can... get through this whole little facility in, in this session. Uh, that's where it came from, right? Right? But no, I would have to... 
I guess not. Oh, yeah, I'll touch the water. <laughs> not water. Sewage. Waste. Get up there. Get up there. Don't fall. Ugh. There you go. Where's the other one? Isn't there a third one? over here. Nothing. Oh, could I hop in a skip over there? Is that box worth it? Whatever's in there? Mm, let's try it. Why not? Let's get crazy. Okay. That's almost perfect. it from here. <laughs> I don't think I did that. I did that. Yeah. Uh, 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 whatever. All right. I gotta change the little islands. What do you think's out there? More power. Okay, um, do I want what's out there? It's kind of a walk. Uh, yeah, I'm not so sure about that. Not feeling it. Unless there's a safer alternative over there. Get to the car. Oh. Oh. Oh, the oh, skinless one. What the? Oh, and a cop. Oh, no. Okay. What the? Oh. Hey. Stay still. Okay. Where's the cop one? Are they cops? I guess they're guards. Not like police officers. It's Black Mesa enforcers? I forget. Compound cops? Compound cop. Hmm. Okay, car. I see the car. car. Uh-oh. What's happening here? Oh, jeez. Oh man, this is like the quantum break bridge breaking demo. Or the scene from Quantum Break when the bridge breaks, the one that they showed at the start of the Xbox One generation to show off the tech. It's like that. Um Okay. Are we driving this car or what? Looks pretty cool. Looks like somebody already started on their post -apoc apocalyptic like Mad Max future. But then got pulled away before I could finish stripping the car of the nice stuff. Because uh, post apocalyptic cars aren't nice, so they were just trying to adhere to the aesthetic. Um, but yeah. I think we'll call it right here. This will be a good episode. Alright, so really combat heavy. Uh, big boss fights. Uh, dying a lot. Scarifying. Or scarifying. I would say terrifying or scary. My brain couldn't decide on which one. But scarifying, that's a word. Has anyone used that? If not, we're trademarking it here. Marcus. Uh, mixed media 
Marcus Stewart, scarifying. I want a quarter every time somebody says it. Uh, but thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll be back Sunday with part four of my Half-Life 2 Episode 2 Let's Play. So in the meantime, if you want to reach out to me on Twitter, you can find me at MarcusStewart7. That's the number seven. Uh, you can also find me on Twitch at MarcusStreamsGames. I stream Tuesday and Thursday nights. And finally, because I'm a games writer and journalist, you can find my written reviews um, and any features, depending on, you know, I write for different websites. But uh, you can find all that stuff and more over on my personal website at MarcusWritesAboutGames.wordpress.com. So be sure to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for, I uh, really appreciate it if you do. And until Sunday, guys, uh, have a great night. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you then. Hey, if you're a Sailor Moon fan or love anime in general, be sure to check out a podcast by Moonlight. It's the podcast where I and co-host Jack Gardner watch every episode of Sailor Moon for the first time ever. We give a play-by-play -play breakdown of each episode, discuss and debate theories for where the show is headed, and, most importantly, make a bunch of stupid jokes and idiotic observations for your listening pleasure. Every Wednesday, you can listen to a podcast by Moonlight on Spotify and Libsyn, as well as follow the official Twitter account at APB Moonlight to keep up with new content. Moon, Prism, Power, Makeup, and Subscribe.